first graders! Today's story is called Animal Groups by James Bruchak. The genre or type of story is informational text. Informational text gives facts about a topic. As you read, look for information and facts in the words and photos that show the real world. Let's meet the author, James Bruchak. James Bruchak has many interests. He is a writer, a storyteller, an animal tracker, and a wilderness guide. Together with his father, Joseph Bruchak, he wrote the books How Chipmunk Got His Stripes and Turtles Race with Beaver. As we read, let's think about our essential question. What makes birds different from mammals? Let's get started. Let's take a look at five animal groups. Fish, amphibian, reptile, bird, and mammal. How are animals in a group the same? Fish. Fish must live in water. Fish have gills that help them breathe in water. Fish have fins and tails. Those help them swim. Let's look at the parts of a fish. Fin, eye, mouth, gill, fin, and tail. Fish can be many shapes and sizes. Can you find a fish in this picture? Reptiles. Reptiles can live on land. Some like to be in water. Reptiles have scales on their skin. Let's look at the parts of a reptile. Scales, tail, eye, legs. Many reptiles hatch from eggs. Snakes cannot walk. They do not have legs. This snake slides its long body on the grass. Amphibians. Amphibians spend time both on land and in water. They do not have scales. Their skin is wet. Let's look at the parts of an amphibian. Eye, legs, wet skin. Amphibians hatch from eggs. Tadpoles hatch and grow to be frogs. Tadpoles. Birds. A bird has feathers and wings. This bird's eyes are on the sides of its face. Let's look at the parts of a bird. Eye, feathers, wing, bill. Many birds can fly. Some can run or swim fast. Birds hatch from eggs. This hen made a nest for its eggs. Mammals. Mammals can be many shapes and sizes. They have hair on their skin. Let's look at the parts of this mammal. Eye, legs, tail, hair. A mammal mom can make milk for its baby. Lots of mammals live on land, but some live in water. Did you know that you are a mammal too? All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed learning all about different animal groups. Have a great rest of your day. Don't forget to smile, and I'll see you soon. Bye.